Amen, brothers. Shoo! Welcome back. Good to see you all here for some Star Citizen. Welcome. Happy Friday to you all. Thank you very much for tuning in. Yes, that is correct. This is music from Tennessee. This is music from SnowRunner. The uh, DLC we played yesterday was pretty badass, actually. Love that game, man. Now, if you like a grind, Star Citizen's definitely your game, but man, I don't know. Nothing quite like the grind of uh, SnowRunner as well. Anyway, good to see you all back. Welcome aboard. Dropped a key earlier for Captain of Industry on the Discord, so uh, if you're not on our Discord, hop on. We got some good stuff going on there. I was trying to, uh, I was going to play Diablo Immortal today. And I was uh, I downloaded it, then I had to download it again, and then I was have a, having trouble logging on. So I don't know if there's like a issue or something with the the everybody playing it or something like that, like Blizzard or I I don't know. It seemed cool, but also Star Citizen's pretty cool too. And usually whenever something goes wrong, it makes me think of Star Citizen for some totally unrelated reason. I don't know why. But it's always a good filler game to play whenever. And we played it yesterday, but I'm back for more. Yeah. And uh, Welcome. yesterday I had a hell of a lot of fun. And a lot of difficulty, but a lot of fun, which is more important. Uh, loading up a ship with a uh, ROC, like a little mining unit, and basically going around and trying to uh, mine stuff. It was a lot of fun. So we're going to do that again here today and some other stuff. The game has incredible ships. I'm telling you guys, Star Citizen's got some really cool... Really, really cool vessels and uh, a really great community. So thanks for being a part of it and our community as well. Like uh, Dur... Oh, boy. Uh, inhale... Inhalator. Dur Inhalator. Thank you very much for the seven months. Uh, if you guys want to become members too, by the way, you don't have to click or tap join. You, sh you definitely should to see all those perks that you could get. But if not, uh, you could also get a member bomb in the chat. Somebody's standing by. Someone's going to hit that button at some point, I'm sure. So... Um, I uh, I should say it might happen. I don't know. But you should definitely make sure that you allow for those uh, membership giftings so you can take advantage of that. Because we have a badass community. So, welcome aboard. Good to see you all here. Robert Lee, welcome back. Good to see you as well. Circle 7 salutes. Amen, brothers. We got all of our brothers standing by. Good to see you all here. All right, I'm going to jump in. Um, hey, Jerry, if you're watching or Dot or any of the usual boys... Come on and join me. I actually was um, considering, um, usually what happens in this game is we'll kind of like, kind of mingle around for the first hour and everyone will have to figure out where they are and log in and it takes a while for things to get started. Um, but last time I was able to jump in real quick and, and get started and that was really satisfying. So let's do it again. Let's go ahead and jump into the uh, PU and uh, jump back to area 18 and uh, figure out where we were and what we're going to do. Try to make some money via mining today, take a look at some ships, and uh, find out what we're going to do. Hopefully, whatever it is, it makes us a little bit of bling bling, a little money. Yo, Peter, thanks for the two. Hi, Commander. Hello. What's up, Big Jess Gaming? Good to see you as well. Amen, brother, brother, yeah, yeah. Star Citizen has such a cool atmosphere to it, man. I've only been playing this more often, I think, because I was watching somebody else on Twitch play. I already... Uh, Deadly Slob. The guy who plays a lot of uh, Tarkov and then also played Marauders, and because of that, I think got into Star Citizen. Although I think he was playing that a lot longer. It's always cool to see a lot of people play a lot of different games. And I'm happy to be one of those people, too. Uh, stay away from Lyria. Nothing but griefers killing miners. Oh, really? Oh, that's not good. Well, I guess it is part of the game, but also, that's not good. Don't want to die. If we ever died in this game, we would end up in the hospital. And that wouldn't be fun. Oh, look, we died. <laughs> Alright, boys, let's get going. Oh, there we go. You love space games? Me too. I think this is a game that I honestly feel like I could play every day or whenever for a long time, but then also take a break from and, I don't know, go back and forth a few times. Is this the elevator? Oh, yeah. Oh.
You tried Star Citizen during the free week and your computer died? Oh, that's no good. Yeah, chat, thank you very much for the uh, hundo likes. That's awesome. Susan's algorithm definitely appreciates that. Thank you very much. I hope this is the lobby. Did he hit the right button? I think so. <laughs> Walking around in our underpants. You love the army base building video? Oh, yeah. Um, earlier today, I played a uh, an army base building simulator, which is kind of like... Um, that's like the movies or like... Um, uh, it's like the movies or like um, Evil Genius or maybe even similar to... Um, although maybe a little less like Project... Uh, or, uh, sorry, Two Point Hospital. Wait, I gotta go this way. Can you play Star Citizen in VR? Uh, good question. Chad, do you know? I mean, I, I guess I'm gonna say yes, Asterix, where it's like you can play uh, with track IR. That's close to VR. Oh, this ain't the right way either. I think I was going the right way. I shouldn't have downed it myself. Ooh, pretty. Well, I played Star Citizen about maybe two years now. Just over two years. In fact, I think I played it beforehand. I And if, in fact, I think I was right there. Um, I, I remember when I recently came back here, I could remember like seeing that once long before, like the little, uh, I don't know, the lobby or whatever that area is. So I think I played Star Citizen maybe like five or six years ago. Didn't really know what the hell I was doing. Like I came to this square here and I'm like, what? I, what do you do? What? I, I'm out. And then, uh, yeah. It wasn't until I played a bunch of other games and got more skilled at them that I was interested in this. I shouldn't even say skilled, but more like, um, you know, just spending my time doing other things. Wow, everybody's being weird. Uh... Man, another server where everybody's standing around. I really wish in this game that if the AI derped out, it would just, like, on-spawn them or something. I mean, I guess it looks okay with people standing around, but... Everybody looks like they're trying to, like, give you an NPC quest. That's weird. Anyway, finally we're in the right spot. Alright, so the goal is to go to City Flight. Go to... Probably the spaceport. Go to uh, Crew L1. See if the uh, refinery terminals are working again. Buy the stuff that we need that we weren't able to get last time. And then um, see if we have to load our uh, ROC again. We will see about that. <laughs> yeah, your ship's in another castle. Well, I mean, that could be the case, but we just have to wait for transit. Hey, what's up, Red? Good to see you. Nice. Um, oh, yeah, this is automatic. I'm like looking for a button. But we don't need that. I think this way goes forward. Make every shot count. Amen, brother. Hi, Tan. Welcome back. Where's the space dino emote? Oh, you mean the one of me in the helmet? I think I changed it over to our devil emote. We got a little devil emote because I was going to play Diablo Immortal. And I was, I, I was kind of thinking I wanted to play it. And I kind of do, and then I did, and then I didn't. But I, I downloaded it anyway. I was going to play that, and then it, it was giving me some trouble. So I was just like, whatever. If I want trouble, I'll go play Star Citizen. And here we are. Yo, JG uh, the Kid, JG the Kid with the five bomb in the chat. There you go, everybody. Thank you very much, dude. Dropping a bomb on the community. Thank you very much for the uh, support. The member train is leaving the station. Enjoy all your new perks and emotes, everybody. And don't forget to jump on the Discord for our V Rising server and for members only, as well as uh, giveaways and such for everybody like to uh, get access to uh, a cool free game or whatnot. I try to drop one every 24 hours. 
And uh, sometimes I fail at that. I am human, but I always try to make up for it, too. All right. Well, I may as well get uh, some clothes on before we go any further. Don't want to suffocate to die to death. Tram now leaving the station. Stand clear of the doors. Oh, and yeah, that's not a good spot to stand. I can't believe how I'm starting to become a fan of every one of these uh, ships, by the way. Like, honestly, every ship... I'm not into every ship maker, but there were some, some ships that I just didn't like at all, and now suddenly I'm becoming a fan of them because I see uh, that they don't have to be pretty, or... They just... They gotta be a workhorse, and if they work, if they work good, uh, me like. Where's my helmet that I want? Uh... I know I wanted to... Uh, um, oh, that'll do. Nice. Is this Call of Duty? Yes. What's up, 3v2? How you doing? Uh, have you noticed the more subscribers of YouTube or what now? Uh, concentrated his language becomes? What? Wait, what? I don't know what that means. The more subscribers a YouTuber gets, the more concentrated their language becomes? I don't think I know what that means. The more concentrated his language becomes is not an insult, just observation. I don't know what the hell that means. What's backseating? Uh, backseating is fine in these live streams and such, but oftentimes what will happen, especially on YouTube, is that um, every single time that we'll play a game, there'll, there'll, there'll usually be somebody who comes in who is like an expert, but they don't know when to like kind of chill out with sharing information sometimes, and so one will lead to two, will lead to four, will lead to five, to lead to ten. Ten people will be like just naming off all sorts of information and facts about a game, but it won't be relevant to what's going on at the time in the game. And so it becomes like, people are trying to be helpful, but it's so helpful that nothing can actually be, um, you know, it'll it'll be uh, just not fun, I guess. And it's totally cool if you guys know what's up, but like if I ask a question and you know the answer, that's good. But, if I don't ask a question, thank you. And it's just like I look over and I see the same name four times in chat. And it's just like press W to go forward, press S to go backwards, press A to go left, press D to go right, scroll wheel to speed up, scroll wheel to slow down, uh, shift to sprint. You know, it's like, okay, man. You know, essentially the chat becomes this. And it's just like, yeah, dude. That's real fun. So don't do that. But if I ask, it's totally fine. Or if you have something relevant to share, totally fine. Like, backseating is good, it's just not too much. It's like in moderation. It's like hot dogs. It's like double dog space dogs. You know what I mean? Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. I still don't know what the scroll wheel does, though. And I hope that one day we can actually walk faster in Star Citizen. That'd be nice. All right, a minute and ten seconds, boys. I am absolutely in love with the Drake Cutlass Black, dude. The Cutlass Black is so damn good, dude. And I, I was a big fan of the, um, the Misk. Uh, what the hell's the name of that one? The Misk with the, like, it's got the big cargo hold on it. Whatever that one is, like, I like that one because that has, like, a four-person, um, that's like a four-seater that's really nice. For the latest travel information. But honestly, sure I think every ship should have, like, multiple seats really easily. Like, board. I don't know. Like, in the Cutlass Black, you could have a pilot, co-pilot, and then somebody sitting on the toilet, but then that's it. And it's like, well, what if you want a crew of four? Like, there, ju there should just be more, like, fold-down seats in the game. You know, very easy fold-downs. Um, let's see. Oh, the Freelancer? Yeah, that's it. The Freelancer Thank Max, yeah. That's it. Stanton's capital of commerce. 
Whatever your transaction. Yeah, Tam, put that one on a five, and then if it continues, just put on a perma. Cutlass has four jump seats in the back near the door. Oh, does it does it work that way? If it if it works like that, then that's exactly what what I had for an idea. Vehicle selected. That's cool. Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the Thank following location. All of us Thank you, ma'am. Hold on, is YouTube asking me if I'm still listening to the music I'm listening to? Oh no, it actually came to the end of the songs. Wow. All right, let's listen to Hard Space Shipbreaker music. Brother, yeah, brother, brother, yeah, brother, yeah. Oh, that's true. Yeah, the Cutlass does have the turret in the bed. Yeah, yeah. Good point. But it's kind of weird because, like, I just wish you'd have seats. You know what I mean? Otherwise, it feels like you're driving around in an RV, which is totally true, I guess. I always get thrown around in here. Yeah, this is it. Uh oh. Actually, I didn't even pay attention. What was the. Where was it, chat? What hangar are we going to? I think it's hangar six. Hopefully, we're right. Oh, yeah. No, Raptor, you have to go to Pier 1 Imports. Ooh, look at that. Look at that big O engine, baby. Okay, see, we need more ships like this, and I can't wait for the uh, reclamation ships to... Uh... I, I just love the ships that look like they're um, a flying... I don't know, like a, a furnace or like a like some sort of indu like large industrial thing. Not even spaceships, like more like I don't know, something else. Like a flying refinery. I'd like to really look like it. Uh the allow button should be at the bottom of the chat. Alright, well wait a minute. Somebody was saying that there was jump seats here. Yeah, can you sit in these though? Oh my god, you can? Holy crap. Oh, best ship ever, dude. I didn't even Oh, dude. Oh, my God, dude. All right, every ship needs these. Ah, that's awesome. That's awesome. 10 out of 10. I didn't even know that. I mean, I saw those there, and I thought that's what they were, but I didn't think you could flip them down, let alone use them. That's just absolutely freaking Pogland emote. Oh, no. forgot to turn off my flashlight. Yeah, the uh, Reclaimer we've seen, and the... Starfare I've seen. Starfare is cool. We did we did some mid-air refuelings with that thing. That was pretty cool. Rick has one of those and uh that was awesome.
Okay, gimbal mode. Yep. Okay. Yeah, more and more people are asking me to stream VR games. I think we'll have to do that sometime. We have before. There are videos on the channel of that. I wish I could interact with a few more uh, switches and such. those side doors okay um, damn I love those side doors <laughs> I love how it closes like that okay let's uh, wait a minute I didn't know I could open these two oh what no way Oh, I didn't know that was storage. Wow. All right, let's get out of here. Um, okay, let's go. You love the music? It's like Firefly. Yeah, we're listening to uh, the soundtrack of Hard Space Shipbreaker right now, which is uh, amazing. Uh, I guess you could kind of call it a reclaimer game. Very cool. Badass. Logan, you love the video? Well, thanks, dude. All right, let's uh, get out of here. And let's set a course to the nerd galaxy. Oh, we're already here, Pog. All right, we're looking for a crew L1. What's up, Alfredo? How you doing, dude? We're going to go to the refinery and see if there's any new... Uh... Yesterday, we couldn't really... The, the terminal was broken, so we couldn't really buy what we wanted. We were having some trouble. So we're going to go investigate and see if that's fixed, and then if if it is or if it isn't, we're going to go grab a miner and start uh, looking for gems with our ROC. Yeah, I didn't realize how much I liked the uh, Cutlass Black until I saw somebody else um, kind of flying with it, and then I realized, like, to me, this, this is kind of like the um, this is kind of like the Avenger Titan, but kind of a step up in a few ways. Like it's just the the back end is bigger, so you can put a vehicle in it uh, with ease, or like it, it's like it's larger without being too big. You know, like you can put a vehicle back there and some cargo, and that's about it, and that's like perfect. And I feel like you could do that with like a pickup truck. You know what I mean? Like in real life, you could throw a quad back there with like. A toolbox, some firewood, some fuel, and stuff like that. So essentially, this thing is even more of a pickup truck than the Avenger Titan. And not to mention those VTOL engines are just like, uh, they're like icing on the cake. More than icing. It's like, 
adding another layer and then icing. Awesome. Can you paint your ships? Yeah, there's a few things. There's a few things you can do to customize them. Like, can't you put... Well, actually, one of the things I don't like is that you can't really... I wish you could put a name on your ship, but yesterday when we went to the refinery area, I found somebody who had, like, this protective suit on, and on, like, the side of the suit, it says, like, industrial down the side. And that'd be so cool if I could put some, like, text or something down my ship. Uh, it would be cool if you could customize your ship, like how you could customize tanks in uh, War Thunder and stuff. Like, this is the Cutlass Black, so it's supposed to be, you know, this gunmetal gray black color, but I don't think there should be anything stopping you from that, but it's probably something they'll add eventually with more customization. Amen, brother, brother, amen. Names and logos would be cool. That's true, yeah. Like, if you had a, um, like, a organization or whatnot, you were... Like, if you and a few friends had some um, cutlasses and you'd like to do mining with it, it'd be cool to put, like, you know, Jack's mining or something on the back of it. How old am I? I will not tell you that, but I will tell you I was born before um, David Hasselhoff sang next to the dismantling of the Berlin Wall. What's up, Loblo? Good to see you back. Welcome. Yes, yes. Boomer emote. Yeah, that's right. Is this still a multiplayer game only? Um... Well, yes, it's the, the whole premise of the game is that you're in a citizen in a universe. Is that Serenity? Uh, the music is from Hard Space Shipbreaker. We played that a few times on the channel. Hard Space Shipbreaker is really nice. I think, that, I think uh, Hard Space Shipbreaker, No Man's Sky, Star Citizen all go together really well. You know, like, sometimes I feel like just doing a quick... Actually, I wish I could play that. If, if Jerry was around tonight, I would have loved to have uh, done the No Man's Sky stuff. I, I like to play uh, No Man's Sky with him. He's pretty he's pretty cool with uh, knowing what's up with the expeditions. Yeah, Squadron 42 will be their uh, single-player version. True. Good point, chat. See, that's good backseating right there. Cube 1VX knows what's up. See? That's good backseat. No, that's co-piloting. That's there's the difference. Co-piloting. Be a co-pilot. Don't don't uh, don't be a backseat. Be a co-pilot. Be a navigator, bro. You wonder how salvaging and Star Citizen is gonna play out? Me too. I'm sure Rick's probably already got a ship for that and dot. But I think that's what I'd like to do. Is uh, that's really the thing I've been wanting to do that I just haven't even got a clue as to what will do that like what will be done no man's sky is awesome in vr yeah i think yesterday um playstation had an event that we saw yesterday that showed that uh playstation vr 2 is going to uh have vr uh no man's sky which is going to be cool so it'll be even even better Brother, brother, amen. Yeah, DCS is cool. I haven't done anything publicly on YouTube, but I have um, gone through the startup procedure of the uh, SU-25 once when it was like free and kind of first came out, but I'd like to play that with Pinto or Bradford and uh, fly like a helicopter together or something, do some missions. Kind of cool. All right, kids, we're almost there. Woo. Are you okay with this long hyperspace time? Well, if it wasn't long, it wouldn't really simulate uh, space travel. So 
you know, like the the transit time is different based on all the locations. Like for example, we just we just flew from here to here, basically. So like, imagine flying from like Earth to Jupiter in like 30 seconds, or like two minutes or 10 minutes. Like that's nothing. Like you can't even go to the store and fight traffic in 10 minutes. That's pretty damn good. I think it does a good job of simulating distance that way. Oh, for sure, yeah. Well, Star Citizen, I mean, you can see a lot of ships from Star Citizen. You know, like, other movies inspiring that. Like, when you walk inside the Hammerhead, all you can... If you've ever been inside the Hammerhead, all you can think of is just, like, an uh, alien. Like, that's all I... Whenever I go inside that ship, it's just like, oh, I'm Sigourney Weaver now. Okay, we gotta get a little closer. Damn, the engines on this... You know what this really reminds me of is when we played Marauder. Uh... I love the engines that look like they're, I don't know, Earth engines. Pretty cool. The Cutlass is a cutie. In that ugly utility way, you know what I mean? Alright, let's make a phone call real quick. Let's order a pizza. Man, it looks like we're right inside this thing. Yeah, I've been... I, I really want Star Citizen, how, like, you play Star Citizen, to be, like, how you would play a IRL game, where... Could you imagine, like, playing a game where you could do construction and take, like, construction jobs and then work your way up? But have to do it, like, imagine a game that combines, like, American Truck and Euro Truck Simulator and farming simulator and all those games together where you're simulating multiple jobs? That'd be amazing. I would love that. That would be a ma- a why, why do I have 37 million now? I ended yesterday with 30- What the hell? I had 15 million? Or 13 million? Now I have- Last night I had 33 million, now I have 37 million? Stop sending me money! Chad, you keep doing that where you keep sending me money. Stop that. Enough. I have enough money. I have to earn some now. Let me earn some money. Although, uh, thank you very much, Jeff, for the kindness, though. That was very nice. Also, stop. Stop involving me in your illegal laundering schemes. What's up, Joe? Yeah, I'm surprised at how close we have to get to the station to call. It always feels like I'm, I'm like, landed by the time I have to make the phone call. Yeah. Get $37 million, then go buy a Mustang and try to squeeze a, uh, a shoebox-sized box into the uh, back of the ship. Hilarious. This your first time watching? Welcome, Brian. Back end's a little lower than I thought it was. Oops. First try.
Uh, Mustang's your starter ship as a little guy. That's a fine ship. I prefer the Avenger Titan, but the uh, Mustang... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I was... Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, okay. Shh. Calm down. Shh. Okay, that was way off. Oh, yeah, the... Okay. Yeah. That'll buff out. <laughs> hey, it didn't explode, so, you know, any landing you can walk away from. Real talk, indeed. Real talk. You know, if you don't look at it at all and just picture a good landing, that was a pretty good landing. Uh, Raptor, I hear air raid sirens. They've allowed membership bombs. Oh, God. Is chat going to start with a massive... We're going to get, like, derailed. I think the biggest um, member hype train so far that rolled through town was when we literally had a train in uh, my time at uh, Sandrock. It was like a railroad track that rolls through there, and chat was just like... Like, I got investigated by the IRS. Chat was just like... Dropping bomb after bomb. All right, let's pick up some burritos. Got to grab some burritos and uh, water for our mining ops. You got your nine-year-old son watching? You're, <laughs> you're introducing him to Raptoria early. Amen. Well, here's a, here's a burrito in honor of your son. This is a... Uh, a I don't even know what it is, but it's probably good. Oh, it's a chicken one. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, wait, I can't store. There's no pockets. All right, well, I'm just going to walk around with this burrito. Don't judge me. Okay. Until I get my backpack. Hungry after a long trip? Hell yeah, I am. Grab a bite to eat. Thought I was going to say more. Low blow with the big O' heavy bomb. Low blow coming in with that medium bomber. Good run. Good effect on target. Nice job, dude. Chat getting bombed out. Member bomb emotes in the chat. And again, don't forget to say thank you, chat, if you ever get a, a gift bomb from anybody. Don't forget to say thanks to them for their kindness. About five minutes left in your ship, Cutter. Let's cross the T's and dot the I's. You love this game? Yeah, me too. You know what's really nice is to see... You know, e tr channels even larger than mine, just trying to experience the game for what it is and just enjoying what's here currently. This is a game where I think, um, I think this is going to be the type of game where it's like doomed if you, damned if you do, damned if you don't. Where it's like, if they announce that the game is just finished now and just like, if everything that's currently possible to be finished was just like suddenly wrapped up in a nice bow. And it had more than what was, what was in here now, but they just said some things were impossible and they just put a bow on it. People would be pissed. But if they keep adding stuff and, you know, keep making the scale bigger, people are going to be pissed. So it's like, you can't please everybody. Damn, look at that. That's so damn cool. Need a hazmat team to head down to the sub deck. We got a camp spill. I ain't walking under that. Hell no. Elevator deaths are a classic. Oh, yeah. I've died... I think I've died mostly in the... Um, in that one giant yacht ship. I always forget what it is, but... I always die there, and also... I died a couple of times in the gap between a... vehicle and... Um, 
Management just wanted to make a general announcement to check your bow sets. We've been noticing things in process. All right, people, listen up. I know this is some of your first live streams, but we're going to have a good time. Now, don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Turn on the notification bell. Management has had a lot of reports lately about people not getting on the Discord to get uh, free giveaways and such, so make sure you're on there. Okay? Link is down below in the description. Now, uh, as a reminder, don't forget to, uh, you know, once you say hi in the chat or put a one in the chat, okay? Don't forget to, uh, you know, read the guidelines and whatnot. And the title and the description in its entirety. All right? Okay, 10 4. All right, you guys are the best. Uh, let me uh, figure out how to do the uh, emote thing now. Oh, that's my bad. But how do I. Wait, isn't it F1? No. Oh, F and right click, thank you. Dismissed. Okay. All right, that took 15 minutes, but all right. Okay, I'm out of here. Bye. <laughs> I'm the be best stealth gamer ever. They didn't even see me. Damn it, the terminals are still broken. Hi. Good to have you back. Hi. See anything you like? Oh, boy. Well, I'm not even going to buy that if I can't buy the helmet, but... Happy Friday to you too, Earth Hugger. Yeah, you can use your uh, webcam to uh, like imitate your body movements or your your face and stuff. Unfortunately, we have to buy everything one by one because I think the terminals are busted again. Which is fine. This only takes a moment. We're almost done anyway. We just got a few new items in, so um, make sure to check them out. No, damn it. Okay, good. We got everything we needed for suits. Now let's buy a tool. This game looks amazing. It is. It's fun. Did I buy the backpack? I think I did. All right, let's get let's kit kit out now. Get out of town. That's fine for backup for later. In fact, I could just leave that here because if I ever come back, we can just leave that in savings storage. Uh, how long did it take you to make 37 million? People just keep giving me money. So I tell them to stop and then, then that just gives them to give me more money. So I'm just going to not mention it, I guess. Or maybe I could pay it forward and start paying like Jerry and everybody else for their time. Because a lot of my friends have been really helpful and nice. 
and very patient with me and teaching me. Joe Beezy is a little raptor. Welcome aboard, dude. Thank you very much for the support. Oh. Nah, it's busted. Oh well. We'll come back later. Can you be a smuggler in Star Citizen? Yeah, there's going to be some illegal missions coming soon. Um, so there'll be more. I mean, there's already some in there, but there's more stuff coming soon, too. I think we're good to go. Bounty hunter? Yep, you can become a bounty hunter. At ease, man. Thanks for coming out to the stream. Okay. Oh, you're right. I forgot I'm wearing my yellow my yellow sweater. Yeah, I don't know what this is. Management just wanted to make a general announcement to check your valve settings. Whenever I... We've been noticing it picks up green? It picks up green and yellow like it's the same color. Like, what the hell? Good point. I don't... I'm not here right now, Chad. If you'd like to leave a message, press 1. If you'd like to win a mem gifted membership, press 1. If you're here mistakenly on accident, press 1. Yeah, the, the webcam thinks that the color green is the color yellow. Whatever, I, I guess. Uh, give me a membership. What? Oh, membership. I watch you for seven years. Oh. Well, I can't give you one. Like, I can't even become a member of my own channel. That's only for chat. YouTube won't let YouTubers become members of their own channels. That's reserved for you guys. Brother, yeah, brother, brother, yeah. Don't wear yellow on streams, yeah. Well, otherwise I never wear this hoodie because I never... Because it has yellow on it because I go invisible. That's fine, you guys... You guys can live with it. It's fine. Can't we just get along? No. Fine, right, let's, let's leave. We're done here. Brown, 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 brown. Um, yeah, we're leaving. We're probably getting towed. Did we get towed? Oh, wait, I gotta buy food. Hey, where'd my burrito go? Where's my burrito? Where's my burrito? Damn, citrus beef? Badass. Probably in storage, honestly. Old man Sherlock dropping a five bomb. Good effects on target, my man. Thank you very much for the support. Chat, don't forget to say thank you. Thank you, dude. Appreciate the support. Our character. Oh, yeah, we look like um, Norman Reedus. We look like uh, Sam Porter Bridges. I mean, kind of. I mean, I, I could see that. Oh yeah, I could see that. A little bit. Dude, that outfit in Death Stranding is awesome. I love that game. So many people were... When I played it, everyone was like, this game is dumb, why would you... And now it's like, whoa, bro. That was awesome when I first started playing it. And now it's even better. I think we got towed. No, we're fine. Pad four still. I'm double parked.
You know who we should give some money to in this game? We should give like $5 million to Uthris so he can stream this game more. Oh, Jerry streams this more too. Yeah, I've been meaning to uh, play Death Stranding again. I did when it came out on PC, and then now it's on Director's Cut, or whatever it is, but... Oh, this will be interesting. Oh. Yeah, there we go. You need to stream it more when you have time, yep. Yep, this game's a... Uh, I have a newfound appreciation for it alone, too, because I realize... Like, there's there's quite a lot to do whether you're playing alone or with friends. With friends is great, because the, the power of, like, working together with friends is cool. Yo, Robert Lee, thanks for the tee hee <laughs> with the five lemon, dude. Appreciate it. Yeah, going out and mining on your own is accomplished too, yeah. You feel accomplished. What's up, Reeker? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Did the burrito physics in this game are 10 out of 10, yeah. All right, let's figure out where we're going. So, um, oh, oh, okay, last time we went to Hurston, I think. And we were trying to mine out, like, at Aberdeen. But we had some good luck at Ita, so let's go there. Now, uh, let's see. This moon was named after Ita Hurston, who died during the first Treveran War. Reminder why the products used Hurston Dynamics makes are so important. Guns? Whoa, what the... I'll just go to the planet first. I don't want any trouble. Yeah, that's better. Oh yeah, Star Citizen's had a lot of lore. We've never really paid attention to it, because... You know, who wants to do reading when you can look at how cool everything is? over there. Mr. Raptor, your look reminds me on Grizzly Adams, dating myself. Thanks for bringing all these titles to light. Uh, thank you very much, Lord Hog, for the uh, five, and I'm glad you uh, appreciate that. Thank you. Joe with the five bomb! Chat has left the station with overwhelming support. Thank you very much for all the gift bomb emotes. And Joe, thanks again for supporting chat with the uh, five bomb. Where to? We're going to Hurston to go to Ita to go mining. We'll make our way to the surface of one of the moons of Hurston. And then we'll start mining for gems. Which is a lot of fun. You've gotten into solo mole mining. Ooh, that's interesting. 
I do like the mole. I think that's a really... I think that's really challenging mining. Um, I think me and Jerry and Red have done that before with... I think it was dot flying and it's... Uh, you need a capable crew to work either independently or together. But sometimes you need two people to, to fire up on a rock and then the third person just needs to remain productive to remain profitable. You'd recommend Amberdeen for hand mining? Better for striking rich? Yeah. It's a little spicy on that planet's surface. We'll jump around. See where the good where the good booty is. Low blow with 140. Thank you, dude. Appreciate the big O Poor brother, yeah, brother. That's a custom song for you. Love the content, Raptor. Try my best to always watch. You keep streaming, I keep watching. Specia shout out to Raptoria Chat, Legends of the Game. Yeah, shout out to Chat, hell yeah. Keith, you love yourself a Cuddy Black? I agree. Good shit, my man. This game needs a space helmet with a cowboy hat on it. I agree. Any tips for the best way to make money on uh, getting a prospector? Well, you could rent some ships. You could you could rent the ship that I have right now. Or, or well, actually, you just rent a prospector and then just grind your way up to getting it for yourself. But then you could also just rent this ship too and like continue to. I mean, honestly, it's on one hand you want to make money for new ships. On the other hand, you can kind of rent some stuff just to experience it too for some fun. So you know, if if you want to rent some equipment, if you want to rent like a Cutlass Black or buy one. And then rent like an ROC. I just bought one because it's just like these two just go together so perfectly. Like they they fit wonderfully together. Uh, has the griefing been addressed at all? Constant ruined my experience. Um. Well, we certainly get attacked from time to time, but usually if you're a bigger target, that's. I've only had the most amount of trouble when we were in a mole for mining, but. Typically, it's not a problem. But they do happen. But that's, you know, that's piracy, and that's kind of goes with the game's lore. How do I like the game? I like this game a lot. I think it's really good. I think it's, um... I want to see more games attempt to try to give you a lot of jobs in a world... Another game kind of like this is like Motor Town or American Truck Simulator or Elite Dangerous or Euro Truck Simulator. They kind of give the same vibe of like, or a farming simulator. Although you don't really leave too much in that game. You can kind of manage land, but. Whoa, that planet needs to slow down. It's going too fast. Okay. Where's the energy level? Here it's level 69. Nice. Um, I'm optimistic for getting some good booty today. We'll see where the booty at. We got rid of all the hard part. Like yesterday we did a lot of hard work of, uh, you know, going and buying some stuff that we needed. Now we can just go pick it up. Uh oh. Did I mark that? I, d I don't think I said course. There we go. And another five bomb in the chat. That is from uh, Tony. Thank you very much, dude, for the five bomb in the chat. Don't forget to say thanks. I know. It's amazing, dude. Thank you very much. Let's get it going. Thank you very much, dude, for the support.
No, there's safe zones in this game. Lots of safe zones. Armistice is what they call it. Uh, this game is both multiplayer and solo, where I've done both. It's been a long time since I've done solo, but... I mean, it's, it's a lot funner with friends, but it's also more enjoyable if you do both, I think. If you play for a couple of hours alone and then your friends want to join, it allows you to do different things. It's kind of cool. Okay, so we're going to, uh, we'll go to Ryder then. Go take a little peek first. What's up, Hellnir? Good to see you. I think Chat's really happy that it's Friday. Chat's having a hell of a Friday, I can tell. Oh, you're right, dude. Yeah, the engines, yeah. The engines look like a space heater. If you've ever lived in, like, the Midwest or anything like that and have ever worked on, like, a vehicle, holy crap, is that spot on. Jeez. Wow, yeah. That is, like, synonymous with the Midwest, dude. Every single one of my uncles and grandfathers and everybody... Everybody had a, like one of those space heaters. Like, son, this was handed down from my for from our father before him. Like, before electricity. Son, this is from this is from uh, the year 920. It was handed down from my father when he worked on his carburetor before him. Like, what? Okay. No, you can't build bases in the game at the moment, but it could be something they could do maybe somehow in the future. see a hab down there. Oh, wait. Is Oh, there. There it goes. Wasn't loaded in. Son, your your great-grandfather Thaddeus Tucker used that space heater during the Danish raids on England. I'm like, okay. Is this Star Citizen? Indeed it is. Welcome aboard. Decent. That was alright. Give myself a B minus on that one. Eh, B. Alright. Now 
No, there's manual and automatic uh, landing. But I, uh, I always land manually. No reason for it, just what I do. Oh god, shit. Okay. Hey, Chad. <laughs> uh, am I drunk? What's going on? The hell? The way this dude's walking, it's like he's walking up on somebody who was heard you was talking smack. I'm, walk I'm walking like a T-Rex. Great. Is this on console? Unfortunately, just PC for now. But maybe one day. get a vehicle now. Someone had their ship blow away before? Really? I feel like if you landed, it could use magnetics to like link to the landing pad or something. Oh yeah. Got a cycle. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. Thank you, ma'am. I would like to have my Grey Cat ROC, please. 14 seconds, but I want it now. Please visit us again. Goodbye. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following Please location. Visit us again. Goodbye. There's the whip, boys. All right, let's go load it up. Uh, Raptor and everyone, what is the potato's worst day of the week? Mashed Potatoes Day? I just made that. Oh, God. Okay, all right, okay. I take it back. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, Friday, okay. I'm gonna just have to start crawling around, Jesus. Is there a realistic year as of now? Um, you mean release or are you talking about like what year this game takes place in? Cause the year the game takes place in always moves forward. Like it's like, it's like moving in the same time as on earth, you know what I mean? Do I have the Pembroke armor? Uh, I couldn't buy the helmet and stuff for it, so the terminals are kind of glitched, so I didn't get it. Cause I, if I'm gonna go Pillsbury Doughboy, I wanted to, I wanted to go full Doughboy. Systems activating. 
Not doing well, are you, are you, Raptor? What? Not doing well, what do you mean? Oh, you mean me laying on the uh, outside of the door? <laughs> oh yeah, a rough day. Okay, that backup camera is a little annoying. Stop it! Okay. Okay, camera, stop being a pain in the ass, would you? fine. Alright. Like a glove. Looking sexy. Uh, chat, how do I do the thing where I adjust the scanner to the front again? What's the hotkey to adjust the scanner to, uh, to like focus it? chat let's go look for some booty get a little away from the station press the any key all right we'll head over here And the hunt begins. Oh, hell no, I ain't getting that. No way. Uh, nah, it's not worth it. Literally on the side of a mountain. No, thank you. Cool planet, dude. It's, it looks super believable.
All right, we'll go over this way. Shawarma, shawarma's better than pizza? Wait, you're writing the word sh sh shawarma. You mean shawarma? Dude, shawarma and pizza can come together. Together at last, like nuts and gum. Uh, is this the music from Heart Space Shipbreaker? It certainly is. You have a good ear. All right, so now we're just looking for uh, gemstones, basically. That'll do. we might find some dolomite that's fine the purpose of today's stream really is just to like find whatever we can do and try try to make some money for our time even if it's not the most amount of money even if it's not as profitable at least it'll be something what is this game like that's like star citizen if you've ever watched a live stream of star citizen going on right now you, you kind of know what this is like eh, eh, get, let me out eh, eh. We'd have to crawl out the passenger door then. We need more games like this, man. Like, I'd love to be able to, you know play a game like American Truck Simulator where I've got to deliver like a bulldozer or something and then I get to use the bulldozer. That'd be amazing. Does this game have a lot of glitches? Ask me in five minutes. Alright, Chad, get your sunglasses on for safety. Safety fourth, remember. Here we go.
Uh, my upgraded membership will kick in after my gifted membership ends. Thanks, Raptor and Chat, for the membership. Oh, thanks, dude, for continuing your membership. That's awesome. Yeah, see, that's the kind of backseat we're talking about. It's like the, the load screen tip backseat. better. Is all the mining this way? Yeah. You can, uh, you do it by laser, kind of like this, but you can do it with a, like a flying ship, or by vehicle, or by like a little, like a little gun. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I think so. to go.
Alright, that'll do. Alright. All done. Here comes the money, boys. How much is this worth? I don't know. We'll find when we uh, bring it back. We'll see how we uh, how we do. Hold your laser still over the ore to get it all. Are we really at that level of load screen tip now? We're, we're really at that LST now? Wow. Wow. I I didn't know. You find rock mining very uh, relaxing? I agree. Kind of nice to be able to, like, be out here in a vehicle. get most of it, but I'm not going to get all of that. Uh, yo, Ben Newton, thanks for the dollar. And Mulu dropping a five bomb on the chat. Thank you very much for the big old bomb and run. Member bomb emotes in the chat. Don't forget to say thank you. And if you want those memberships too, make sure you tap that little uh, rectangular box in the chat. And make sure you click allow so you can claim your memberships as well. Thank you very much, Mulu.
Alright, we'll get two more and then we'll head back. Alright. Let's go home. What organization am I in? Uh, we have our own mining group or something. We have a... I forget exactly what it's called. It used to be a mining group, but I think it might be something different now. It's on our Discord. Wow, look at how badass that looks, dude. Absolute... That's sheer badassery right there. That looks nice. Earth hugger with the fi bomb. Oh, Tampa guy, I'm surprised you didn't say it was called the Chinatown Mining Company. I'm sh I'm surprised you didn't say that. I shouldn't have said that. Ripping and dipping mining concern. Amen, brother. You would never be so predictable. What? I'm surprised you haven't changed your name to Chinatown guy, not Tampa. Unless Tampa has a Chinatown. How the hell with this? The more I try to park better, the worse it gets. I'm just gonna say screw it. That's fine. That that's paddle buff out. All right, where's the guy who was asking about glitches? Right now I'm in the crawl space. Okay, well there you go, Michael. <laughs> I jumped up into the crawl space above the ship, somehow. Oh, I'm gonna need a beer after this day. Okay, we're good. First try. What ship am I looking forward to being released? I want to see how the uh, re reclamation ships work, and I, I want to do that, like get a feel for how it works, you know? I'm excited to uh, see some of the new stuff. I think that'd be cool. That's just what we were, wasn't it? Eh. Let's keep looking. Yeah, I know. I, I have this sudden urge to, like, start cutting these ships apart. Seriously, if you want something to hold you over before the reclamation ships are here in Star Citizen, get yourself Hard Space Shipbreaker. That game is amazing. Really good. Really good. I want to play it some more, but you know. 
I gotta take a break. That's that's like a favorite, recent favorite game, especially for like it kind of being like a, kind of like a puzzle game a little bit. A little bit. out here but I don't see anything what's up Shane you love the uh, content well thanks for watching uh, you have way way too much money in the game if you ever want to go do some large ship content let me know oh boy we'll be into that soon one day Probably when the reclamation stuff gets here. Okay, let's go check out this one. Is this the only mining ship? Well, this is a cargo ship. And we're transporting, like, a mining vehicle in it, but... This can transport, you know, a vehicle. It can transport cargo and people. This is like a... Just think of it like a, like a delivery truck essentially. But there are ships that can do specifically mining. Prospector is one. The Mole is another. For example. What's up, Dre? How you doing? Yeah, I would say the, uh... I mean, I really like the Avenger Titan, but this is like a good, like... If the Titan's not big enough for you anymore, the Cutlass Black is perfect for uh, you and a couple of friends, really, to do some, like, just, just even, like, if you're doing uh, hunting contracts or something. Zack with the five bomb Damn, Chad is bombing the hell out of this planet. Thank you very much for bombing chat with some gifted memberships, chat. That's awesome. All right, that's some ore. Member bombs in the chat. Don't forget to say thanks to Zach if uh, you got one of those memberships from him. Don't forget, chat, to turn on those gifted memberships so you can get access to those. Have I ever flown the Reclaimer? I've been inside of it um, right when I started playing Star Citizen, but I haven't I haven't seen it even since then. Not in game, at least. Been a long time. Oh, we're looking for like yeah, any sort of any gems. Well, that's gonna be a uh, an ore right there. It's fun though, just cruising along a planet's surface like this is really satisfying. Like, not much might be going on right now, but at least it looks pretty. Yeah, you could start, you could buy a ship in this game for like $45 to uh, do some basic contracts and like uh, bounties, but the uh, Avenger Titan is also very, very fun as well. But the Mustang is cool. I saw somebody using the Mustang recently and I, I didn't know how fun that ship actually was. I, I don't think I'd ever seen anybody do combat in it. At least not in our crew just yet. Poppy Playtime? That seems cool. Horror games like that? I'm more of a, like, a simulation city builder type guy, though. A recent one that I've enjoyed, if you like, um, you know, vehicles doing work in games, like, you know, Farming Simulator, ATS, Flights, and that type of thing, uh, Factorio's good, but I enjoyed, uh, Captain of Industry recently. That's been a lot of fun.
Right on the edge. That's got to be ore too. Hey Raptor, hope you're having a good day. I have played NMSO using that as a reference. What's your experience with Star Citizen related to NMS? Thoughtful face, dollar bills face. <laughs> Thanks, Dark and Flame. What's my thought of this compared to No Man's Sky? Well, No Man's Sky has a lot of fun travel, and it's very fast, and you can see a lot of stuff in a really short amount of time. And it's really cool to, like... Yeah, No Man's Sky is a really good, like, exploration game and base-building game. Uh, this is kind of more like if you wanted to simulate work. <sighs> Star Citizen is to... N Farming Simulator and ATS as No Man's Sky is to like Minecraft and um, and I can't quite think of any other analogies for it but it hits different for sure but I think if you like No Man's Sky you're going to like this game no Man's Sky, Star Citizen, and uh, Hard Space Shipbreaker are three games that I think go together uh, very well. But it's like comparing brats and uh, hot dogs, you know? They're good, it's just kind of like what you're in the mood for. Oh, here we go, finally. All right, we'll stop here. Whoa, 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 whoa. I just tapped control on that one. Dark and Flame with another two, so more like uh, E for Star Citizen and Minecraft for No Man's Sky. Hmm. Well, like Elite Dangerous. This feels more like Elite Dangerous. And in fact, Elite Dangerous updated to try to kind of be like this. Oh, I landed literally on a rock. Uh oh. Oh, what the hell? Ah, uh, yep, that's right. This is music from uh, Hard Space Shipbreaker. Yeah, Elite Dangerous has been having some trouble, man. I I'm kind of sad for them. Because Elite Dangerous is a hell of a game. Elite Dangerous is a lot of fun. But I think Elite Dangerous does a little bit more of the, uh, the quantum stuff a little bit better. The quantum travel in uh, Star Citizen is kind of hands-off. But I like what you have to do in uh, Elite Dangerous because it feels like you're coming in for a final approach. It feels more involved. Like, you know, landing a 747. Still a great game, though. Ah, that's right. These big tires will get up.
Yeah, I think the uh, No Man's Sky stuff's pretty cool with the whole, like, um... I don't know, having to, like, slow down or whatever. Too much, but gotta get some work done. Oh boy. Uh, yeah, I haven't brought any uh, gems back yet, so I'm not sure, but. Alright, well, let's get some dolomite. This will be fine. Is there a quest line in Star Citizen you can follow? Yeah, there's quite a few quests. Different bounties and delivery quests. Or just grinding and making money from mining. Find some more. go. baby. There you go, Joe. 
Enjoy, my man. my home state known for? Check this out. The Juicy Lucy, bud. Basically a burger with cheese in it. You'd think that'd be a Wisconsin thing, but... We own the copyright on cheese and beef. Oh, I noticed tans in the chat. Seriously, XK, thanks for the two. Titanic music, you want to hear the Titanic recorder music? Honestly, it doesn't it doesn't show what we're really known for, which is tater tot hot dish, dude. Not casserole, hot dish. Oh, those exploded everywhere. Yeah, you could uh, pilot pretty well with a HOTAS. For sure. Good enough, boys. Right, let's head back to the whip. Got 
Gonna take a whole lot of flooring, boys. Wow, that was like the easiest load up ever. I'm not even gonna try. Woo! Amen! So low blow, thanks again for the 20, bruh. Thank you very much, dude. Let's give you a little cowboy. Oh yeah. Amen, brother. All right, let's get the engine started. There they go. I'm more for the space cowboy. Amen, brother. Amen. All right, let's listen to some new tunes, shall we? Bring it over to the snow runner, brother. We do the full... There we go. Let's do a little Tennessee ambiance. You're just over here missing the Titanic music? I know. If we can launch a rocket into space, we can do it. Maybe. Wait. Did I do this? Yep. Alright, let's go uh, explore. We'll probably go back and play um, Planet uh, Crafter sometime soon. All right, let's go explore a little more. We'd also go to another planet, but this one's beautiful, man. I like all the wind and stuff. It's kind of cool. Planet really blows. This game blew my mind. What's the most efficient way to make money? Um, well, it kind of depends on what you're, who you're working with. Like if you're, if you're working with a group of friends, if you got somebody who's got some, you know, high value bounty targets, you could definitely make a quite a bit of cash in a short time by uh, picking up bounties and working together to take out, especially what their bounty level is, you know. And then splitting the money for the contracts or whatnot. But additionally, mining is pretty good with the prospector for a start. But usually, the the most fun is to to do mining and then mix it up with a little bit of like uh, doing some bounties with friends or you know like it doesn't have to be. Um, you know, like space-based bounties too. You can do some ground stuff, depending on who you're who you're teaming up with. Do we have enough wood? We certainly do. More wood is needed. Oh, never mind. We got a shortage, a deficit. Oh wow! Brad Labs is streaming uh, Terraria right now. Wow. Is he playing with Red? Betrayed again. Are bunker missions worth doing? I mean, everything's worth doing in the game to experience it. Um, you know, if you're trying to, like, maximize your money and, like, you know, make absolute top-tier money at all times, it's probably going to be between mining and, like, some higher-level bounties. But again, it just, it just depends on, like, the more you grind into bounties, the better bounties you'll get. So it's, like, it's, not, it's certainly not worth it at the start if you're just trying to do one thing to get money quick. But it's, like, the more time you put into the bounties, the more, the more they'll be worth over time. But the, uh, 
the bunkers are kind of like a, they're a good like thing to do once in a while and always fun to be able to use your guns and and uh, especially going down into them is pretty cool but you know some of the times if you're if you're playing this game a lot you want to you know mix it up with a do a couple mining halls and go do a bunker mission then a bounty then back to mining and then do another bounty again it's good stuff uh dark and flame welcome dude is a raptor hatchling green eyes in the chat show him some love thanks dude for all the support you want to do some bounties sometime? Yeah, for sure. We'll do a big... Um, I'll try to get everybody together. We'll do a big O thing. Oh, that's true. Yeah, you could do some cave mining if you take some cave bounties. Yeah, true. Then you... Yeah, it's the best of both worlds. You do a little cave mining and a little... little shooting, scooting. Works out. The only thing is the the cave mines uh, take a little while, but they're about as long as it takes to like, like what I'm doing right now. If we were doing something else, like the cave bounties, it takes the same amount of time. You know, we'd have to find the cave, work our way in, pop some dudes, go slow on our way out to make sure we got all the all the guys on the way out. I don't know if I can get to that. This looks like one. Cave mining is fun with the groups of groups of friends, though. I will say that <clears throat> you know it's it's still a game though, so like fun is fun doesn't equal money. I mean, it's certainly satisfying to do a job where you get paid a couple, you know, a couple hundred thousand. But you know, if you have a brutal shootout and you escape and some other people ambush you on the way out or something and you kill them and you get some loot. Loot's also a thing. Oh, that's one thing we got to remember too is that you can you can take loot now and sell it. So even if you uh, go on a mission where you have to shoot out with a bunch of dudes, you can you can take some of their guns and equipment and sell it when you get back. So that does make the bounties a little bit more uh, profitable. Or you can keep it for yourself and save money. Yep, check pockets, yep. Raptor doesn't work for money in Star Citizen, just receive millions. I told everybody, oh no. Did it go up? Okay. I told everybody to stop and then they just did it more. I'm gonna be a damn oil prince by the end of the night. Dark and Flav, thanks for the five. It would be cool if they could mix Icarus slash the forest with Star Citizen. Good point. That would be a real good combo. Uh, we're on the moon of Ita. I-T-A? Uh, it's next to Hurston. We're just cruising. The planet's dusty. This is nice. I like being a cowboy. on the dusty planet. We'll head back in a little bit and drop off our booty and see what we get for cash. But honestly, right now, we're, we're in no hurry at all. Have some fun. I'm actually surprised we got a lot of hydrogen fuel left. Or damn near like 80% tank. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're channeling uh, Terran vibes right now. Oh, here we go. Come on, baby. Oh, damn.
got two nearby over here. This is a good spot here. SCV reporting in. Roger. Do a little nighttime mining. Yeah, it's a shame we never got StarCraft as like a... Man, I wish... Terran StarCraft like missions could be like what Warhammer 40k is. You know, like in Warhammer 40k, like... They've got 13,000 different like Warhammer games now. It's awesome. Like there is so much stuff for everybody. It's amazing. <sighs> I wish we would get that with uh, StarCraft. Imagine like a StarCraft city builder, a StarCraft like mining game, Star StarCraft game where you're just an SCV. SCV reporting in. That'd be awesome. Just the atmosphere. Like, atmosphere for me now is like 90% of the game. Like, I don't care about graphics. Like, if you make a good atmosphere, people will love it. Stardew Valley, Minecraft, Fortnite, all look different, but they all hit different too. Oh boy. This will, uh, this is fine. Oh boy. That's fine.
boom. Extraction mode on. Getting them. Hey, uh, Ralph, Ralph, dude, you, you want to calm down for a minute and chat, dude? Relax. Okay, one more to go. Are 30k still an issue? I have not seen one of those since like a year and a half, so I'm gonna have to say for me, no. I have not seen that or heard that term in a long time. Okay, let's see. aspect of Star Citizen do you think you will like the most when more functions slash ships are added? Mining slash salvage slash bounties slash exploration. Really looking forward to like data running, salvage, and um, 
more expanded mining, but yeah, I, I definitely want to like, I think the exploration and the data ships are going to be interesting, but uh, yeah, once they add the, um, once they add like reclaimers and stuff, like salvage is going to be bad AS. Extraction mode on. That's going to be super cool. Alright, there's a few more meaty bits. Landed it. Extraction mode on. I think that's close enough. Rather than chasing down every little bit. There's a few out there, but... Let's get back on board. Can you steal ships? Yeah, you can. Now we're just mining anything we can get so that way we can uh, just make some money, feel, feel like we're being accomplished, you know? Mm, this will be interesting. Well, let's try this. I wonder if we could actually, like, jump it. No way. Chat's gonna owe me, like, $500 if I could do that. No way. I'd never be able to do that. A million dollars. Million dollar bet, chat. There's no way. No way. I went right through that rock. There's no way. Alright. Jeez, imagine explaining this to the insurance company. Well, you see, what happened was... Probably gonna die of dehydration before that happens.
Wow, cleared it. Damn. Wait a minute, if that works, then this will work. Come on, girl. We'll move you a little bit. This will work. I need like forward momentum here. First try. What the fuck? Oh, come on. Oh, wh what the f Oh, now it's just, now it's just pranking me. What the? I just got like, yeeted off my own ship by like a, like a force push. Luke, are you on board? Oh baby, go, go, go. All right, we, we're out, we're good, we're good. Ugh. There we go. All good. That was that was something else. You see, things like that make this game a lot more fun. Didn't make us any money. But it's an experience. Thanks, chat, for 400 likes, by the way. Appreciate that. Thanks, chat. That's cool. I like chat. Chat's nice. Yo, look at the lights on this ship too, damn. What's not to like about the Cutlass Black, man? What a ship.
like a glove. Boom. Wait, how full is this thing? Nice recovery. Love the streams this week. Have a wonderful, bear-free weekend. Yo, Punch Tape, thank you very much for the five. You too, thank you. How can I tell if this is full? Are we at 56% full? I don't think that's what that means. Cargo bay in the... Oh, I gotta check the actual cargo bay itself? Okay. Or you can do it for mining mode, okay. Oh, that's a little too close. But it's kind of cool that you can you can also empty this out, right? And put it on the ship. So if this thing gets full, we we basically have extra storage with our backpack and our ship, so that's cool. Oh, we're good. We're not even halfway. Nice. No, there's no bears on this planet, Chad. That's why this is the best game ever. There's, there's no bears in space, so thus, best game ever. Oh, wait, we need to have a little sip. 26%. Whoa. Let's have ourselves a brewski, bruh. We are in this break. Let's take a seat. Break time. Ah, oh, boy. Okay, let's see. Put that in the storage for now and have a... I guess we could have a water. My character was dying. Okay, I'm drinking the water, but it's not animating it, but whatever. Tell chat. I don't want to go back to prison. Oh, 
what? The heat will melt it. Fine. Okay, the drinking animation not being here is weirding me out. What the hell is this music? I better not be DMCA'd for this. It's actually good. This is SnowRunner music? Oh my god, this is good. Wow. Well, it's empty. Don't you need your helmet on when you open the hatch? I mean, yeah. But, you know, magical space. Uh, how do we start these engines again? Oh yeah, there it goes. It's an old ship, you know. Well, um... I think we should go sell what we've got so far and go, go see, like, what we make. We're not full, but... Let's switch it up a little bit. Let's go back into space. Actually, isn't the best place to sell here at the Habs? Where's the best place to actually sell? On the moon? On this moon? Or should we go somewhere else? We only have gems. We have dolomite. Dude, we can make maybe three, four dollars off of all of our work. Sell it at any outpost with a trade terminal. Smelt it? Refine it? Oh, it's crystals. Can we do that? I don't know if you can smelt it down, can you? Yeah, I think we can only sell these. What, where's the better place to sell gems, Chad? we go to, um... Hurston, or should we just go to a... Just any old mining outpost here? Take a look around. be a good spot. land here. Man, super chill.
All right, we're going to sell this and make some money. Coming in now to sell. This channel's been your favorite since 2016-2017. Wow, dude, thanks for watching. Love hearing that. What's up, Benji? How you doing? Here okay, we're about 55 meters away, 55,000, 5, meters away. Oh, thank you, Low Blow, for being here, dude. Welcome aboard. Thanks for being with us, as always. New member, welcome. Always welcome. Shadow, thank you for becoming a Raptor Egg. Welcome aboard as well. Green Eye emotes in the chat. Show them some love. Alright, we're 2,000, then we're touching down. I'm just taking it slow, because, you know, we're fully loaded with booty, and I don't want to crash. You know, be a sweet game chat. I just thought of this. Uh, being one of the um, Dune Spice Harvest Simulator. Being one of the harvesters on Dune and one of the uh, carryalls that come and pick it up. That'd be badass. That'd be a cool game. All right, so how do we sell what's in the uh, thingy? Do we have to go to a terminal? Oh yeah, getting eaten by a worm. That'd be a, that'd be hella cool. Let me make sure I'm wearing a helmet. This is the big moment, chat. We can make four, maybe five dollars. I'm telling you, four, maybe five. What's the random uh, devil emote? I was gonna play. Um, I was gonna play uh, Doom Immortal tonight, but I tried to download it twice, and then I tried to like log in, and it was giving me trouble. So I, I guess their servers were like overloaded or something.
You hope I get enough for a burrito? Me too. Sorry, Diablo. Sorry, I was thinking Doom because of the video I saw yesterday. Or a bolt caster, whatever it's called. Um, do I sell from the ship or is there a terminal on, on the pad? Terminal inside? Oh, okay. Alright then. I guess we're gonna have to go a little further than I thought. This building here. cool thing is, is uh, you can sell directly from the ship. You don't have to like bring the little vehicle out, which is cool. That's a good little, little perk. You know what? Actually, I wonder if there's loot in here. Let's check. I've bought at least 10 games I've never heard of after being introduced to them through your streams and videos. Thanks for that. Your great raptor, keep it up. Uh, thank you, brother. Um, appreciate the big O support. Wow, Eric with the hundo. Thank you very much, Eric. I'm, I'm glad you enjoyed the channel, dude. Thank you very much for your support. Wow. Glad you appreciate the channel. Oh, now we're looking like like a crayon exploded. Now oh, we look like a, look at we look like a goof. Look at how much of a goof we looks like. Oh no. I like it. <laughs> we skipped leg day. Oh, this armor's not bad. It's worth uh, a little bit of cash, I suppose. It doesn't even have a proper description yet. Didn't I grab, like, a tan helmet and stuff, too? But anyway, that, that's one thing you can do is, like, you know, you can always loot stuff and get extra money. Technically. Those are Nicolas Cage and Con Air Arms. Wow. That is an accurate statement. Hey, there's more loot here. Whoa. A backpack for our backpack. Oh, 
Oh, this is a red color. That's fine. Alright, I think that's all we're going to find. So let's uh, take that and then we'll go sell our stuff. It seems okay. It's a little extra money. Oh, wait. Hey! Darn doors. Ooh! Hello, beautiful. Okay, I've made more money now just stealing <laughs> from this base than, uh, wow. We've made more money stealing from this place than we ever did mining. Okay. Oh, wrong way. What? This must be the airlock then. You can steal? Uh, no, we, we would never do that. This is a uh, temporary uh, acquisition. Hold on, now, now I really want to check things thoroughly because there's a lot more here than I thought. Okay, we're good. Yeah, stealing, five minutes. Every time you steal, you make as much as you uh, would an hour of mining. Wait, let me check this again just to make sure now. Actually, I'm, I'm good. Yeah, this is a reallocation of valuable mining resources. Oh. <sighs> oh, I'm gonna have to sue. They didn't even put a slippery when wet sign down. I'm suing the hell out of that 7-Eleven. They're getting the hell sued out of them. Candy in here? Damn. Oh, water. Actually, I, sh I should probably take those drinks and snacks. my stuff. I left it here before you started working here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
breach yet. Now we have a witness. What the hell? Need something? No. I mean, yeah. What? He must be silenced. Make thirty one thousand, nice. Okay, well, that wasn't zero, but we made more money by uh, borrowing. Yes, I said that borrowing, sir. That armor, borrowing, sir. to that other building and grab stuff. Jesus, every time, man. We're gonna just go, you know, put stuff on our ship now that we found. Totally legally. Shiny engine is shiny. Those blue ones must go with the uh, helmet I got, maybe. I brought snacks. We got snacks for the uh, road trip back. Sweet. That was easier than clicking the like button. That was easy. No, that's not true. Subscribing is easier. And turning on the notification bell. Much easier. Oh, let's put these uh, personal ones in there, too. Let's, um... How are we doing on, like, water and stuff? Let's go to a different planet. A different moon.
You want me to eat a burrito? Uh, all right. That's probably a good idea. Oh, we're all good now. Yeah, we made it. We made some good money. Now we're just kind of like uh, trying to snack. Oh my god! All right, we have to go grab food. Don't mind me, Chad. I'm going to hold the burrito while I fly. I'm a uh, professional. I think. Okay, I think what we'll do is we'll fly back to Hurston. And then we'll, uh, go to Hurston and then we'll get some grub, food and water, make sure we're good there. We're going out to eat, we got a dinner date. Johnson, thanks for becoming a raptor egg. Welcome. Green eyes in the chat, brother. Yeah, yeah. All right, so now, okay, so we sold some good stuff. We got like 31,000. Not, not bad for that, but the armor, that's where the money is. So we can hold on to that for a while. Now we got to go to this really small town. This really small city. It's called Lorville. Have you guys ever heard of that? <laughs> Where is that? Oh, there it is.
cool. Alright, I wonder if it starts us close enough. Probably not. I think three or four people live here in this town. Very small. It's like Comcast Global Headquarters. We have to nuke this place from orbit. It's gotta go. Hmm. Too dangerous. Actually, this is uh, this is Planet Electronic Arts, you know, Planet EA. This is the uh, microtransaction division, over 4.3 billion employees. Cool. I never like slow down long enough to actually take a look around this place. Alright, a little closer. I didn't even call you yet. You called me. Bro, you called me, sir. He's not even... Okay, there it is. Jeez. It's the big moment, boys.
can't even see. There was a you know what'd be really cool is if when you were landing if you could do like an ATC view or like you could see yourself uh, from the ATC like if, if we could be up there looking at ourselves as we come in we could see our you know pitch roll all that kind of thing, and then just level it out and bring her on in. But manual landings are fun. Okay, time to grab food, because I think we're starving to death. And these burritos apparently suck. Yep, it doesn't count that we're eating the burrito. Had to stre stretch out my neck. It was a long flight, you know. Hey, pal. I uh, I'm not gonna be eating this. So if you want it, you want a Florido? There you go. Look, we're buddies now. Open wide. Nah, I can't throw it. Well, that sucks. Whatever. All right, let's take stuff out of uh, storage, and we'll store it here. Dude, look at that burrito. That looks good, though. Like, if that's beef, that looks like... Some, I mean, that looks like some pretty damn good beef. That's some pretty good beef physics, y'all. Leave it there. You guys can tell where I've been in Star Citizen if you find like a bunch of, uh, you know, burrito trail. Okay, let's uh, get stuff out of here. Go back on board. Um. Your wife is mad at me for showing you the game. Oh, it made you happier. She should. She should be supportive. Just make sure you clean your room.
looks dumb. Maybe I'll just keep this all on the ship. I was thinking about maybe selling it here, but if I if I just hoard a bunch of stuff for a long time, if I just become a hoarder, like we're at, what one one percent storage, I'm probably gonna end up dying anyway. This this stuff would be good to keep, and there's extra snacks on board. But um, I think we need to go back. Okay, so I think we should go sleep. Will that fix it? I oh, know med bed, right? If we go into a med bed, that should fix the whole like not being able to eat thing. Because if we can't eat, then we're not going to be able to, uh, you know, like we can bring a billion tons of food with us, but ain't gonna ain't gonna be good. We'll die to death. All right, I'm going to the med bay. If the ship blows up, I'll lose the loot. Yeah. That's probably fine. I mean, it's okay stuff. But it'll probably be more beneficial for me to keep it on the ship. Because knowing me, I'm more than likely to die outside of it. Go to Med Bay. You haven't seen the new hospitals yet? Oh, they've been around for a while. They're pretty cool. I always forget the number to 911, though. That guy's in a hurry. So much security, but they're like, it's like they're heavily armed, but they're like, they're just facing the wall. Like, yeah, great security, buddy. All right. I don't see a Wendy's on this list at all. That's a shame. Bumblebee, I love you. And Transformers, come here, give me a hug. Okay. Oh. Step away from the platform edge when train is approaching. Chad, are we on the? Oh, they're they're firing up the engines. We're on the hype train. going to micro center Ooh. 
Is that a real person? Yeah, that's another player right there. Look at him over there, just playing the game. What do you think he's thinking about? I bet he's thinking about becoming a Raptor Sigma member. Sigma Apex. That's Sigma Apex material. That's got to be Jerry. Is that Jerry? Hold on. Let me let me tab out for a minute. Platform edge when train is approaching. Jerry, is that you? Person security reserves the right to search travelers at any time. That's gotta be that's gotta be Jerry. I bet he's thinking about burritos. Is that? Wait, what? What food can we get on this planet? Is it burritos? What? what what's for sale here? I think it's just. I think it's just uh, burritos. In her generosity and a philanthropic inspiration to the millions of lives she's touched, this hospital is proud to be named after the unparalleled Maria Hurston. To honor her work and her memory, we will be sharing select excerpts from her seminal work, Dynamics of a Mindful Life, throughout the day. We encourage you to listen with an open mind and a pure heart. Uh, hello, I'd like to purchase one health care, please. Whoa. Maria that, that guy's going to need uh, triage. We need triage here. Often the very last to get repaired. Sir? She, of course, was talking about the human body. That's why yearly wellness checks are so important, not only for your health, but the health of hey, no push dynamics. It. Talk to your doctor about health care. Ask if medical treatment is right for you. Sure. We all want to Ugh. I'm not going back outside, hell no. Okay. Where's the check-in terminal? I know there's like something we have to interact with, right? Hi. Let me know if there's anything I can help you with. Oh. Hi. Let me know if there's anything I can help you with. There we go. Floor one, room nine. Is this for a private dance? You want a shout out for Lieutenant Dan? All right. To return to your job? Don't let your recovery One's in the chat for Lieutenant Dan. Some medication and treatments may affect your motor skills and alertness. Be sure to discuss side effects with your doctor or pharmacist. Minimize 
Well, those hydroponics over there are just hitting different. Oh, and this is room 18. Wait, Ward 18. What the hell's the room? In her book, Dynamics of I gotta go to room 9. Oh, this is it, right here. Okay, let's have one medical treatment, please. Uh, sure. Good, there we go. Food and drink back up to the hundo. We're good to go, boys. Yeah. All right, we did it. First try. Hey, man, brother, brother, yeah. Wait. Why doesn't my guy... My guy doesn't, like, blink or anything. He's just jamming out. Music hits different. Who the hell? Who the hell's in my? This is supposed to be my room. Hey. Who the hell's taking a shower in my room? What the hell? That was supposed to be my private. Health isn't merely the concern of the individual. It takes everyone working together to build a healthy and thriving community. Out of the way. That's why. Way to get this man. Fourteen hundred cc's of pizza roll stat. Code magenta. Code magenta. Oh god. Sorry. Oh boy. Out of the way. They can be done. Uh, security, he can't pay his bill, so uh, I'll let you take him down to the incinerator. Hey, okay, bye, I love you. Attention, all Hurston Dynamics employees. Please inform your manager immediately before taking medical leave. An authorized medical exemption <laughs> is required as proof of inability to perform your duties. want to be able to work longer hours, but overdosing on stimulant is not the answer. From a higher chance of accidents and mistakes to a decrease in performance and quality of work, Person Dynamics reminds employees that too many stints slows you down. We lost him.
Oh, the bodies in the hospital are free. You could take them home. Cool. Of a mindful life, Maria Hurston encouraged all patients to repeat the following healing affirmations to inspire and motivate healing. I will be grateful for the care given to me. I will focus on my positive energy rather than on pain. I will put my faith in those responsible. <laughs> I, I will actively dedicate myself to the Tee hee law. <sighs> We're going for a brew, ski brah. Oh, nice. This bar is sweet. So you can get down from there. It's probably nicer if you take a seat. Oh, two bartenders? Hell yeah. Yeah, what do you guys want? Good choice. Um, I'll have, um, if you have, if you have any, um, I'll, just give me like a, Oh, I don't know. Um, do you have a water? Oh. Well, that'll do. The hell, is this a block of cheese? What is this? I think I spilled it. Oh boy. Um, are these? What can I get you? Oh, well, I have one already. Oh, I'll take that though. Well, give me a beer. Uh, give me that liberty, brother. Yep, coming right up. You know why this is stuck to my hand? Also, I think I'm wearing alligator skin gloves. Um, this is fine. Hey, what the hell? I what can I do you for? What the hell? I paid for my beer. What the hell? Bro, I paid seven dollars for my beer. Hey. Jerk face. I paid seven dollars. Good choice. Don't take his order. What the hell? I paid. If he gets his beer first, I'm gonna be so mad. And I want to mine from the bottle, not from the tap. Oh, those posters are cool. He got you a sponge, bro. This bar is a scam. You pay money to order things, they walk over and then come back. That is, there is no tip, sir. This is an outrage. As soon as I figure out how to stand up. Or that's a pretty big gun. Here, this one has cheese in it. Try this one. What do you want? There you go. Right 
Is she chewing the cheese? That's some pretty chewy cheese. Uh, why don't you go to the hospital and get that gurney? I think we're going to need to bring her up. Hey, I ordered a beer, damn it. Where the hell did the beer go? Bring me a... Uh, the, the top one. Sure, that's a dude? I don't know. I don't care. I need a drink. I swear to God, if he pulls that damn sponge out, mother. F this is an outrage. I'm leaving. One second, right? <laughs> it's synthetic ice. Who the hell operates a bar like this with literal trash in the... I'll take that. Is this where my bar, my beer is from the bar? Bro. Listen. Dude, the bartender... Dude, he scammed me, dude, of seven do fourteen dollars, dude. I did it twice. I got scammed twice, dude. Twice! I mean, you know, scam me once, shame on you, but... No, I, I'm... That... Whoa, okay. Oh, okay. Where do you go? Yeah, me too, buddy. I've had it up to here with the service, too. Yeah. All right, whatever. I'm going to go uh, upstairs. Oh, dude, is this like a ramen noodle bar area? Oh, man. Ooh, slot machines. Scam. Oh, I thought there was like... Looking good. get out of here I remember we went up some stairs oh yeah we came this way so that's it's through here right oh it's there okay dude there's a ramen dispensary man I love that okay so the next order of business is Probably to think of maybe possibly buying another cool ship. The Cutlass and the ROC has been pretty sweet. But, maybe we'll go to... Oh, are you hanging out with us? Hey, what, what's up? Bro, are you a walkie walker too? Dude, I walk everywhere. Sweet. Yeah. I'm gonna go to New Deal, cause I'm a streamer.
I'm a walkie walker who stream is streamy. Uh, you're pretty sure they're laggy? Bro, we had a couple drinks at the bar. Okay? That space cheese just hits different. And we're all just a little, you know. I'll tell you when I've had enough to drink. New Deal has prospectors, that's true. I think I own one. But not like the attachment. You can go to Tammany and get water and meat chunks. Oh, that's right. I gotta, I gotta actually get more food. Well, no, I got some on the, I got some on the ship. We're good. We got some like candy bars and like juice. Your fellow travelers, do not lock doors. Now arriving, stand by and let passengers disembark before Rain. Rain's boarding. coming. Rain, the train, it's coming. Rain, ah, it's the train. Yo, Manic, thanks for the six months as a raptor egg. Ooh, the New Deal has the Connie Phoenix? Ooh. Oh, sweet. We're here. We're at the wrong place, but we're here. Actually, isn't there like a gun store at the top of this place? Or something? I remember there's something up at the, up the top of the elevators. You just lost 1.7 million? Uh-oh. Oh, it's ship weapons? Oh, I don't know if I want to go up there then. Well, we'll go inside. I'll never... If I don't go inside now, we'll never see the inside of this place for the rest of the year. Jeff Bezos' laundry room. Jeff Goldblum. Dude, security sucks here. Like, look. Like, no one's allowed in here, but they're not looking at me, so it's like, we snuck in. looks cool.
Oh, these screens don't even work. I swear, isn't there an elevator for us to go up somewhere? What's up, Evan? How you doing, dude? Thanks, chat, for 500 likes. That's nice of you all. Thank you. We can go up to the CEO's room? Oh, good. Under... Hello, Mr. CEO. You're under new management. Out of the way, boys. Oh, the door is locked. Damn. Exchange certainly is pretty quiet. Like one dude down there. I'll buy a vowel, Pat. Private trading. Yeah, it looks pretty private in there with the giant window that I can see through. I was trying to do a hostile takeover, but All right, I'm gonna go back to my uh... Uh, I forgot where I was gonna go We had to take the ship, but why I mean the we had to take the train where was where were we going chat? Oh, yeah new deal Totally, I, I'm hungry. Sorry, I, all I can think about is food. I mean, in real life and in game. So, hey, buddy, do you have food? Okay, bye. Hey, pal, any food? Oh, get wrecked. Frickin' parkour, what's up, biatch? All right. Hey, where'd that other person go? <sighs> yeah, I did a lot of mining today. I came back um, to... To sell, well, actually, I, I sold stuff and then I came back to, like, not die because I needed food and water. And I had to go to the hospital bed.
Bueno, bueno, bueno. Uh, Dustin, how long have you been watching the stream, dude? Person security reserves the right to search travelers at any time. Yeah, that's what I thought. Ten minutes. That's what I thought. <laughs> What's up, Shane? Shane, thanks for the dollar. Thank you, dude. Another Shane, check it in. Oh my god. This is the first time I've seen another fan of mine in the game. That's awesome. So many fans in this game, it's great. Another one. Wow. Oh my god. Dude, run through it. Run through it, bro, bro. Run through it. Oh. I have to do this for Jesus. Ready? Go! Ah. Jenga. Rah, I won Jenga. Hell yeah. F you, Jenga. Can't stop me. Okay. Seppin' Wolf, thanks for the dollar. Appreciate that. Oh, you gave me a... You gave me a dollar for the uh, for the jump I did earlier. I got gotcha. you. Uh, New Deal looks so cool. I love this place. Oh yeah, there's the Mustang we saw yesterday, and the Hammerheads over there, and the um, Constellation, I think. been on that ship a few times, the Hammerhead. I want to check the Mustang. I've never been in that ship. I don't think I've ever sat in the Mustang. Maybe. Maybe I have. Oh yeah, I have. Never mind. Yeah. Look, look at me, look. I'm a I'm a pilot, look. Oh. I think that's the manager. Alright, last thing I'm going to do is go inside the ship. 
Uh, the, uh, sorry, the, the New Deal dealership. That ship. Different type of ship. I don't... Bro, I think we're gonna be the first person in Star Citizen history to buy a dealer ship. Hey, welcome to the New Deal. I would like to purchase. We have a whole bunch of new inventory you're gonna to wanna to check out. Yes, give it. Real nice stuff. Give it all to me, thank you. Ooh, the limited. the prospector good ship good for mining bro where'd you get this shirt I'll buy it how much bro this guy looks like Caesar look at this This guy's Caesar, dude. Bro. I hear he makes good salads. Blushy, blushy. All right, boys. Well, that's going to do it for me for tonight for Star Citizen. So thank you, everybody, for uh, tuning in. I'll be back in a few days with this one. Probably won't play this this weekend, but I want to come on back and do some more mining and whatnot. So thanks to everyone for being here. We'll come back and do some more mining soon. I'll have to think of some other stuff I want to do. I really like the, the Cutlass Black with the uh, ROC in there. Maybe we could do a, um, a thing where we get a few of you guys together and we can all do some mining together. However... With the surface mining like that, it doesn't really work out so much because everybody's got to, you know, you got to spread out so you don't oversaturate the area, but it's all good. All right, boys, Circle 7 salute. I'll see you all tomorrow, bright and early, for more Big O streams on the channel, including a new look at the upcoming, uh, or rather the currently updated uh, Going Medieval. Now has pets and animals and stuff, so now you can do animal husbandry. And we'll go to... Um, Uh, whew, I don't know what we'll do tomorrow night, but we'll figure it out. Plushy, plushy. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow. We'll uh, come on back for more Star Citizen soon. I'm loving it more than ever, dude. Playing it single player just hits different. Anyway, have a good afternoon, good evening, a good night, and a good weekend. And uh, for those of you who just became members, don't forget to jump on the Discord uh, so you guys can get access to our V Rising server. You're all invited to that if you uh, don't have keys already. I'll probably drop some more for that in a few days. And, uh, yeah. So, anyway, I'll see you guys soon. I'm hungry. I gotta go eat. Goodbye, buddy. I'll see you all next time. Thank you, brothers, brothers. Amen. Yeah, brother, brother. Yeah, brother, 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 brother. Aftermath, you're funny, dude. I mean, Afterburner, you you make me chuckle, dude. Come on to the uh, streams more often. Plushy, plushy. Last minute snipe from Stefan Wolf. Thank you, dude. Have a good one, folks. <laughs>